Mid-sized firms are absolutely critical to the uh, UK's economy. Uh, they tend to locate themselves and employ lots of local people. They tend to spend most of their money locally and um, there is many opportunities for these firms with um, improved access to markets, improved management skills to uh, generate growth and help uh, rebalance the economy. Adnams has been successful over the last few years really because it has been quite innovative. It's been innovative in its approach to um, sustainability. It's also been innovative around its product range and, and the way it, it goes to market. These innovations have, have helped uh, build the Adnams brand and has absolutely transformed some of our relationships with some of our really big customers. I think it's about long-term sustainable growth, so I think it's about investing for the long term. I think it's investing in our brand and investing in the way that we go to market, so making sure that uh, we keep our uh, impact on the environment as low as possible as well. So that's those sorts of things uh, combined together are part of our growth plan. Being publicly listed is, uh, in my view, a positive thing. It brings with it all the disciplines of being a publicly listed uh, company. Uh, it also means that we have to adhere to governance uh, regulations and uh, we also take governance very seriously in the organisation. So we have a very effective team of non-executives who help check us through what we're doing, help us develop strategy and really are wise heads that we can refer to at any time. I think this is about building our brand as an employer as well as building our brand as a consumer brand. And uh, around five or six years ago, um, we are in a very rural location on the east coast of England, and it would have been difficult for us to get the brightest and the best. As we've built our brand, as we've bought, built our reputation as an employer brand, that has become less of a problem. Uh, we also work very closely with universities and with the further education sector, and that's been very positive for us as well.